New at noon, Miami-Dade schools are preparing for an emergency. They held an active shooter drill today following all the recent mass shootings across the country. Local 10 News reporter Annalise Garcia reports from Coral Gables. These officers hope they never have to use these tools, but they do prepare and train for the worst. From the moment an active shooter situation begins, everyone involved on high alert. The corridor is not established, stand by. In Miami-Dade County, our law enforcement teams are trained specifically to neutralize threats swiftly and immediately. A very realistic training activity with Miami-Dade Public Schools at Coral Gables High School Friday morning. When I heard the screams of those children, I could only imagine what those that have already gone through this horrific experience went through and what their last moments were like. Let me see your hands, let me see your hands. Officers armed, canvassing the school hallways, children and teens acting as students, crying and screaming for help. <laughs> Medics working their way in to help those acting injured. This drill preparing these officers for the worst. On the second floor, we had nine yellows, two reds. Our cops uh, trained to go in go directly to the threat and neutralize that threat like I mentioned before. And that means make the bad guy real dead real quick. And we are willing to die for that cause. Chief Edwin Lopez assures families their team is prepared. Our team is coming out. But has a message for parents. Monitor the behavior of your children. Monitor the usage of social media. Monitor the usage of the computer. We are relying on you as an additional layer of security. Miami-Dade Schools Police has an officer at each one of their schools daily to make sure that these students and staff are safe, but also to make sure that they know the ins and outs of these buildings over anyone else. In Coral Gables, Annalise Garcia, Local 10 News.